I'm a professional astrologer, and one thing that has always grinded my gears is how trauma can really mess up someone's ability to interact with zodiac signs that they have a natural compatibility with. I had this roommate who was a Leo, right? His mom was a Virgo. I'm a Virgo. Me and his mom have the same birthday. This man was triggered by me saying hello to him. And what I mean by that is, like, if I called him and was like, how was your day? Because at the time, you know, I traveled for work and I would get bored. So I would call him and be like, what's up? How's your day going? And that would trigger him because that's how his mom used to be. His mom would be like, hey, how's your day going? How are you doing? And me doing that triggered him. Now, mind you, if we're just talking sun sign placements, Virgo and Leo don't have a natural compatibility, right? But even so, that's just one example. Even though his mom and I are years apart in age, two completely separate generations, something as innocent as me saying, hi, hello, how's your day, made him really uncomfortable. And this dude had the nerve to one day be like, CD's a narcissist, he's a sociopath, he's a psychopath, he doesn't care about my emotions, he's not empathetic towards me whatsoever, he only cares about himself. That's when this other friend of mine, an Aquarius, stepped in and said, that's complete BS. That is complete and total BS, and that's not fair to CD at all. I've watched CD on several occasions try to show you that he cares about you, that he wants to hold space for you, that he wants to get closer to you, be your friend, have empathy for you, be a shoulder for you to cry on, and you won't let him. You literally refuse to allow him to care about you. You refuse to allow him to be empathetic towards you because you are so focused on how he reminds you of your mother, you can't make the distinction that they are two separate people. How is anybody supposed to show any care for you if you flip out on them just for saying hi, how are you, how was your day? And you know what the funny thing is? This same roommate would call me all the time and be like, hey, what's up, how's your day? Not only that, he would always think that I was mad at him. And then I'd get mad because he won't stop thinking that I'm mad. Mind you, this guy was like three or four years older than me. And after a certain point in time, I did stop caring and I kicked him out and that drove him insane and I was just like dude you had my empathy at one point in time and you threw it back in my face and constantly accused me of being disingenuous now you're getting the real lack of empathy this is what I do when I stop caring this is why as an astrologer whenever I'm reading people I try to help them understand how their trauma takes form and how to properly confront it without projecting it onto other people that way they don't wake up one day and realize that every attempt they made to protect themselves from the same trauma happening to them all over again just turns them into the exact same abuser they were trying to avoid becoming. Want to learn more about astrology? Sign up for a reading. The link is in my bio.